What is up, gentlemen and lady? I'm sure there's one of you. Uh, happy Thursday to you. Uh, we are doing a long-missed episode of Respawn Inbox where we answer your guys' questions. Um, there will be a link in the description, by the way, to a new, so you can start posting new questions. We pulled some from uh, about a week and a half ago, so we skipped it for COD XP. We're going to rock it out today. We're just going to get right into it. Optic J was kind enough to join us because he's, uh, he's insightful. So let's start this off. Um, Merrick. Kaula asks, Kaula. are you sponsored by Activision or something? Because there's like six Black Op videos a day. Uh, well, people yeah. like to play Call of Duty. That is uh, that is the short of the story. <clears throat> That's a fair question though, but I think the answer is just uh, the content that we post reflects what people are into at the moment. Right now, a lot of people are into Black Ops. Yeah, We do post a lot of fighting game stuff. We post a lot of, uh, we're getting into Battlefield now. We're posting yeah. a lot more outside that, that realm. <clears throat> and that makes me happy. There's a lot of, uh, there's also, cause there's a mix. I'm sure most of you are aware of this, but there is a mix of shows that we make here and then shows that are submitted to us. And we don't tell people what to submit. They submit whatever the, whatever the F they want. <laughs> a lot of people do black ops. <laughs> it's popular. Uh, Angel Lopez asks, "What did Sark do with the dildo when he got back?" I actually, really, really want to know yeah, this. Same here. Yeah. Actually, like you know too. what? Uh, watch this clip. Welcome back. You want to welcome you back, Sark? Welcome you back, man. Hey, check out your office. We give you. Uh... <laughs> let's go. Come have on, a look let's go look at it. Let's go have a look. Hey, this is great, you guys. This is great. Looks great. What's this thing? What is that? <laughs> what, what could that possibly be? What could this be? I'm trying. I'm trying to tell by the shape of it, but it's just so long. It's not like. Anything I remember on my dad. The sexual tension is too much. I gotta get out of here. Constant? <laughs> <laughs> a lot of people wanted to see that. And I think we just didn't put it up because I didn't like, I didn't run around screaming. I was sort of fascinated by the fact that, that somebody would put that inside them. He was huge. Yeah. That would yes. rip you in two. Where Can is you it? imagine having that suspended between your legs? Nope. Did you? <laughs> I cannot. You could like spin on not that. Not in a million. Did you years. throw it away or did you take no, it home? No, I put it into the respawn box of props. It's in there with like our <laughs> rock'em sock'em robots and our our wigs. I'd love for you to take that home and just when you walk in the door, just hold it up to your your wife and say, yeah. "Let's give it a shot. Let's do this. <laughs> Let's us give it a shot." Mm. You said I do. I, I imagine that if your dick is that big, it get it never gets beyond wacky gum hard anyway. Like there's no way you <laughs> Wait, would have. No, same thing happened with John Holmes. I had the lightheartedness. Or the you light have to, you'd have to lay down after getting erect. Yeah. And like go to sleep or something. John Holmes had a 14-inch penis and uh, never, never was. Yeah. Fully hard. You would need like a your pants would need a sleeve. Yeah, it's like a very, <laughs> it's like underwear. You need a for pocket just for your dick. Just <laughs> yeah, a dick pocket on the inside of your jeans. Next question, Chris William, can Nanners have his own talk show, and if so, what would it be called? It would be called the Mongoose Hour, and it would be an hour of mongoose and me. Okay, next question, Ryan Pack. Three questions. Hope you can answer them. One, Hutch, can you say more? Fuck you, Nanners. No, because Nanners is my friend. Nanners said you were gay. Today, Nanners yeah. is my friend. Nanners didn't say that. Say. I don't know why I'm putting myself I'm gonna in say, third bless person. you, Nanners. Thanks, man. Bless you. Thank you, my child. Blessed day. Awesome. I'm gonna have a blessed day. You got day. something in your eye. What is it? You wanna give like my eyeball? Gunk. Gunk. Like gunk. You gotta go which, to the which, which eye? Fuck you, Nanners. No, man. I'm, I gotta clean hey. my eyes. You know what? Hey. I feel really bad about that, but. Did you? Sorry. No, I'm sorry about my friend. This is very inappropriate. Fuck you, Nanners. 
I'm not saying it. God I don't, bless you. Okay. I mean, Hutch, any God bless you. Talking a everyone. lot of trash about you earlier. I'm I don't think. Saying. Fuck you, Nanners. Fuck. Ryan Pack, second question. Sark, can you give Hollywood a blow? Job. And three, can you guys check my channel out when I get it? <laughs> yep. Yeah. If you start Swear up a God. channel, if you, yeah, if you start up a channel tomorrow and tweet it, tweet at me, I will look at your channel. You don't even have to have videos. I'll just click on the page and see what you wrote and you're about me. And I'll get a review of your channel from Hutch, yep. so that I won't have to go look at it. Let's <laughs> say it was UFOs. Do you think the government would be able to keep something like that a secret?